Imagine if I said that each planet is essentially Earth at various points in its evolution and you can see them all simultaneously. Stay with me to delve into how Mercury transforms into a gas giant like Neptune. To start our cosmic evolution story, let's go back to the beginning when there were no planets, gas giants or asteroid belts. There was only our lone star on the verge of bringing forth a single planet. The uniplanetary evolution theory guides us through the journey of a single planet's evolution as it transforms into the planets in our solar system. Imagine a cosmic cradle where a sun births a planet composed mostly of iron. This iron globe is Mercury, our first waypoint in this cosmic journey. It's a unique perspective, isn't it? Seeing each planet as a different age of the Earth, all existing simultaneously. It's a testament to the vast timescales and the intricate processes that govern our universe. This marks the beginning of a billion year journey with Mercury as our starting point. As we venture two billion years away from our sun, an atmospheric transformation unfolds. The stark, barren surface of Mercury begins to change. An intriguing phenomenon takes place as the planet becomes ensnared in a Venusian cloak of carbon. This dense, almost suffocating shield traps sunlight and intensifies the heat of the planet. The temperature soars, and the once solid iron core begins to melt, re-emerging as a molten mass. This incredible heat, coupled with the pressure from the carbon cloak, triggers a seismic shift in the planet's structure. The surface shudders, cracks and splits, giving birth to a new topography. This is a time of intense change, a metamorphosis on a cosmic scale. Under the relentless heat and pressure, the planet's surface transforms, the once smooth and cold iron crust becomes a bubbling, boiling sea of molten iron. This atmospheric evolution sets the stage for the next transformative leap, water. At three billion years, we witness the crowning glory of the planet's evolution, the emergence of liquid water. The planet, once a fiery ball of molten iron, transforms into a water world, a pivotal milestone in its evolution. The molten core, ever stirring, generates a protective electromagnetic field, shielding the planet from harmful solar radiation. As the molten core cools, it gives rise to shield volcanoes, giants of nature that shape the rocky surface of the planet. These volcanic activities play a crucial role in the planet's transformation, expanding the iron core and paving the way for the formation of vast deep oceans. These oceans, cradled by the planet's crust, become the lifeblood of the planet, a testament to its resilience and adaptability. The water planet phase, a beacon of life in an otherwise inhospitable universe, signifies the end of Earth's early journey and the beginning of a new cosmic chapter. Fast forward three billion years and our planet begins its transformation into a gas giant. As we venture deeper into the cosmic timeline, we witness an atmospheric revolution. The once thin veil of gases surrounding our planet thickens dramatically. This isn't a gradual process, but rather a volatile one, marked by intense electrical storms that light up the sky like a cosmic light show. Picture this, a spectacle of lightning, thunder and celestial energy, a testament to the raw power of nature on a planetary scale. These storms aren't just visually stunning, they play a crucial role in the planet's evolution. They trigger an electrolysis process within the world's oceans, splitting the water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen. The released hydrogen, being lighter, ascends and contributes to the expanding gaseous atmosphere. In the midst of this atmospheric upheaval, a new player enters the cosmic stage, Phaeton. This hybrid gas planet, named after the son of the sun god Helios in Greek mythology, takes form in the orbit where the current asteroid belt exists, nestled between Mars and Jupiter. Phaeton, with its hydrogen-rich atmosphere, becomes a dynamic addition to the planetary ensemble. But the life of a planet, much like the life of a star, is a constant cycle of creation and destruction. After two billion more years of storms and atmospheric changes, Phaeton succumbs to the relentless forces at play. It merges with the king of the gas giants, Jupiter, in a spectacular cosmic ballet. The gas giant phase marks a turning point in our planet's evolution, leading to a cycle of destruction and rebirth. The tale of Phaeton is a stark reminder of the transitory nature of celestial bodies. Yet it also points to the enduring cycle of change and adaptation that fuels the universe. It's a dance of elements, a cosmic waltz that shapes and reshapes planets, stars and galaxies. 
In the grand scheme of things, we are all stardust, participating in this endless cosmic symphony. In the cosmic loop, Jupiter stands not just as a planet, but as a life catalyst. Let's delve deeper into the grandfather paradox. It's a concept that explores how our future might influence our past without changing the ultimate outcome. Here, Jupiter plays a significant role, acting as an agent in the cycle of destruction and rebirth. Imagine, if you will, a cosmic waltz, where Earth transforms into Phaeton, a hybrid gas planet. This transformation theorized to occur between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter marks a significant milestone in our cosmic journey. But what happens next is truly remarkable. Jupiter, the gas giant, experiences a cataclysmic explosion, taking out Phaeton, giving birth to the inner asteroid belt. This event, while devastating, is essential for the transformation of Earth into a Mars-like planet. This is where the grandfather paradox comes into play. The paradox suggests that Jupiter, despite its explosive end, reaccumulates and reignites its gaseous atmosphere. It's a cycle of destruction and rebirth, a cosmic circle of life, if you will. Now let's consider the alternate cycle. Here, Jupiter's explosion propels Mars toward Earth. This movement aligns the planets like pearls on a cosmic necklace, with each orbit separated by a billion years. This alignment reveals a mysterious gap between Mars and Jupiter. This gap spanning three to four billion years, presents an intriguing conundrum. It signifies an absence in the cosmic dance, a moment of silence in the symphony of the universe. In this paradox, Jupiter, the future Earth, obliterates Phaeton, the past Earth. It's a compelling thought, isn't it? That our future can influence our past without altering the ultimate outcome. Jupiter's cataclysmic cycle underscores our understanding of the universe, time, and our place in it. So as we unravel the mysteries of the universe, we're reminded of the cosmic dance we're all a part of. It's a dance that continues to spin with Jupiter leading the way, a testament to the unending cycle of cosmic evolution. Thank you for joining us on this extraordinary journey. If you are a passionate explorer of the mysteries in our cosmos and eager to uncover new perspectives, you've come to the right place. We post thought-provoking videos every day, so don't miss out on any of our mind-blowing episodes. Hit that subscribe button now and embark on more awe-inspiring voyages of discovery.